Welcome to Why Money Entertainments. And if you've never been here before, I'm CJ. And look, I am sharing my love for Mickey Mouse. So why am I doing Mickey Mouse? Because I love him. So let me show you my collection. This right here is Steamboat Mickey Mouse. And I got this hi, from my boss um, when I had graduated from school. She went to Walt Disney World and bought me back him. And if you notice, I even blinked him out with a Dalmatian necklace. Say hi. Hi. Then I want to show you my first collection I've ever had. When I was 16 years old, I hit Sweet 16, and my mom said, what did you want? And I said, this phone. So this phone I've had ever since I was 16. I'm so glad it was Sweet 16. So technically, this was my first boyfriend. <laughs> so let me show you the stuff on my desk. When I have my desk at work, this is what I normally have. This is my tape dispenser, and this is a classic Mickey Mouse. And you can then I put my New York, because everybody knows I love New York. My pencil holder and pen holder. I put my famous picture frame. And this is Mickey doing designs all around. And this is a picture on how I used to look years ago. And I was in my grandfather's home country, Trinidad and Tobago. Yep. I'm getting old. I also want to show you my stuff that I normally have in my kitchen. This is my hot plate. And this shows you the years of Mickey. All the years. And these are my coasters. I only bought out two. And it's ears too. See? Now I put this outside when I'm camping. This is my Mickey Mouse toaster that I got at a yard sale last year. And when you toast, it pops up. It's got Mickey Mouse face on your toast. This is from my BFF, one year for Christmas. Um, is Mickey and a dog because I, she knows I love my dog. Now I have a lot of Christmas ornaments and Christmas designs all for Mickey, but this one is really special, so I hang it up in the room. And of course, this is the Mickey that I bought when I went to Florida for the first time. I think I was about 22 something years old, and I always wanted to go. When my parents went, they didn't take me, so. I decided when I hit 20-something, that was going to be my first vacation. So that's when I got this one. But I have been a Mickey fan ever since, technically, I was 10 years old. Uh, stay, stay, baby, stay. Ever since I was like 10 years old. And I'm going to tell you a little bit why. My parents brought me to Ohio, which is where I live now, which is my father's home state. And they decided to take a trip, um, a lovey-dovey trip. Why would you go to Walt Disney World and not take your child? And that's what they did. They went to Walt Disney World and they didn't take me. And they brought me back a watch. Really? And then a watch wasn't even Mickey Mouse. What? It was some Cinderella. Huh? And then I found out this cute Mickey was there. And they, so I took my brother's watch because he had a Mickey watch. And then my mother was like, why you got your brother's watch? And I said, I love Mickey Mouse, not him. And after that, I became a fanatic. So I get shirts. I get hats. I get PSP games. I get PlayStation 2 games. Yup, I got a PlayStation 2. It worked. I got two of them. There's another PlayStation game. I even got Xbox Mickey Mouse. Yes, I do. The Epic Mickey 2. I go around painting things. And one of my favorite videos of all time. I'll show you my jewelry. Because y'all know I like jewelry. <laughs> I had to move some stuff out the way. So now y'all can see my watch collection. Because what are you a Mickey fan without a watch collection? Now, I'm not going to show you the charms that I wear on my neck or the earrings. No. 
It's the watches that I got to show you. So let's look. Come on here, Mickey. Look together. This is my coin watch. If you can tell, I have worn this out. This is a coin that someone gave me. It's my first Mickey Mouse coin. I never knew that they made Stony Silver coins before. This is a musical watch that um, a friend of mine gave me for a, a Christmas gift. And it plays all Mickey musicals. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to play it. So I'm not. This right here was a gift from another friend, uh, Mickey. If you notice, I have a lot of brown watches of Mickey. Up here is my first blue watch of Mickey. My mom had got me this. I just broke the strap, so I got to get a new strap. But if you notice, his eyes is cut again. So that's a collector's item. This was the watch that I told you that my mother bought back from Walt Disney World for my brother. Look how small the watches was for boys at that time. I still have this. I was 10 years old, and this watch still works. It's a wind-up watch. And all you do is wind it up, pull it out, turn the hands, push it back, and it starts to tick. Okay? Now, I want to show you my most expensive watch. And if you notice, I'm styling with my Florida towel. This was a gift last year from a friend of mine uh, for my birthday with this washcloth that when you wet it, it grew. So I thought that was cute. I use this for camping right here. This is the first replica of the first Mickey Mouse watch ever made. If you notice, it's a bracelet. If you notice, he's got that awkward look to him. He didn't get his coolness yet. He still has the cut eyes, and this mechanism at the bottom is what turns it. So this right here is my collector's item. This is just because I love the style, but this is my oldest watch. You may say, well, you got all this Mickey stuff, but what do you wear every day that's Mickey? I have a Mickey Mouse charm that I wear every day. It's a full Mickey Mouse charm, and I have a Mickey Mouse thumb ring and if you notice up close inside the thumb ring it says remember the magic and this is my thumb ring but what do I have on me 24 7 that I can never take it off a black Mickey Mouse <laughs> now what now, I do want to get another Mickey Mouse tattoo. But how I want him and the design I want is a whole different ball game. So, maybe when I decide I get a tattoo, then my viewers or my subscribers can help me pick out which Mickey Mouse tattoo should I get. <laughs> Meanwhile, I want to show you that my phone really, really works. This phone was from 1976. So let me let you hear it. Call me. Who is that? That must be Mickey. Hello. Hey, girl. Where's, Where's Mickey, Mickey Mouse? Mouse? Mickey's over here getting the phone call, girl. We on YouTube. <laughs> All right. See you soon. <laughs> if you like this video, throw your thumb up. <laughs> Slap that subscribe button if you want to see more. See you soon. Throw them likes up.